Now a killer sentence. A man accused of stabbing a Liberian refugee to death has reached a plea deal with prosecutors. Prosecutors say Lamar Wilburn attacked Princeton Miller on a Providence porch after an argument over a barking dog. Eyewitness News reporter Susan Campbell spoke to the victim's family. She joins us now live outside Superior Court in Providence. Susan, it was an emotional day in court, but Princeton Miller's family tells me they're thankful justice has been served. A mother in tears as she listens to her son's killer apologize for his crime. And I hope that I may one day be forgiven by him. Not, not a day goes by, and I wish I could change the past. I wish I could change it. On May 7, 2011, Wilburn stabbed 26-year-old Princeton Miller to death at a home on Monty Street in Providence. Prosecutors say the men had been arguing over a barking dog. This young man took his life, you know, in a brutal way that, you know, we can't get over. On Monday, Wilburn pleaded no contest to second-degree murder. As part of his plea agreement, the judge sentenced Wilburn to 60 years at the ACI with 35 years to serve. At least he realized that it was wrong that you should not take another man's life mm -hmm. for nothing, for dog, for, for dog. a dog. So somehow I have forgiven him because I'm a Christian, but God would, would take control. Earlier this year, Lamar Wilburn rejected a plea agreement that would have meant less time in prison for him. Reporting live in Providence with the Mobile Newsroom, Susan Campbell, Eyewitness News.